Chris Watkin back again at the Guild 2022 conference, and I'm joined by Stephen Wayne, who is a pre proponent of the self-employed estate agency model. Steve, why do the vast majority of people that join self-employed estate agency models fail? Ah, my favourite question. So the, the, the honest truth is like with people who open a business, they're just not committed enough. They won't do what needs to be done and they won't push themselves. And I think they've got this misconception that they'll open up as Chris Watkins Estate, put one advert on Facebook and 400 people are going to flock to them. The reality is I don't think people realise how strong their brands, where they've been are. And I think that's a problem that a good estate agent comes into a self-employed model and for the first eight to 10 weeks, they need to be marketers. You're not getting a house. You need to think about canvassing, door knocking, social media posts, and not one a week, one a day. You need to go out there and engage with your community. You've got to do things which, as I say, you've got to become uncomfortable being very comfortable, be very comfortable being uncomfortable even. And you need to go and do what no one else will do. And what I did 18 years ago, they have to go and hustle. They've got to go and speak to people in the street about their houses, not be afraid to door knock. And especially, the most important thing, is they've got to realise it's going to take end eight, ten weeks before they get any kind of traction. Like You might get lucky and get something on day one, but the reality is you've got to have a plan and you've got to believe in your plan and follow it with conviction. So why do some estate or most estate agents who start their self-employed estate agency model, even though they've got that roadmap in front of them, don't actually implement it? because it, it's a lot simpler in your mind than it is in reality. You know, it rains and someone turns around and goes, oh, I'll do it tomorrow. It's like going to the gym. In all our minds, we all want to go to the gym, be fit and healthy, eat really well, but none of us do. Well, we try. But it's the same thing, you know, Will you go out and do five hours of canvassing a day? Will you go out and knock 20 doors a day? Will you go out and do your prospecting letters every day? And it's about, you know, my favorite line is consistently consistent. Will you be consistently consistent? You know, will you go and do those things? And then when you get finally in front of a vendor, you've got to give them a picture of your life that they believe that you're not just some one man band, but you're actually going to give them that great service and get them what they need. And then when you do get traction, a lot of people then drop it. That's Drop the business generation. Well, well that's not just self-employed estate agents, that's just estate agents in general. You've got to have a plan and you've got to stick with it. And it's like, how many estate agents who you meet, they're, they're doing your letters and then they're doing this and they're doing that. Suddenly they get traction and they can phone you up and go, Chris, it's working. But actually we're so busy we don't want to do it anymore. And that's not self-employed estate agency. That's, and that's not even just estate agents, that's business in general. Follow your basics. Why so many companies go back to the basics all the time. But when you know you get consultants in, we, we've had over loads of consultants and they tell me what I know. And it's all about following the basics, sticking the basics. Whether you have a good day or bad day, you still have to follow that same basic. So basically hard work and patience and just keep cracking at it generally what makes the elite elite thank you for your time today steve listen to what steve's got to say bang on thank you very much steve